brakes. Don't don't be doing the doing it. Stop on the brakes if you're gonna look back and start your. There you go. It started. It started. Okay. okay. Winter Haven traffic, uh, Bloom White, Stop 333, Juliet Sierra, texting out of the FBO, going to be taking a right on Foxtrot and a d right on Echo down to runway 11. Winter Haven traffic. I hope that Foxtrot and Echo should lead to, yeah, it should lead to 29. It doesn't say it on here, it says it's not connected, but I'm pretty sure it is. So take a right. Take a right here on Foxtrot. Yep. Is he, is the the cub going? I don't know where he's gone. He's not sure. Okay. So Foxtrot Echo. We're in the saying he's crossing 2911. Okay. So you heard him uh, announce that. Yes, I did. Yep. So we'll see if we can take a right on Echo and go down to the end. Oh, should be good. Now, one thing, uh, and I'll show it to you on the um, on the diagram. If you guys are going to runway 29, which yeah. is the opposite, yes. you have to taxi all the way down to where all those airplanes are parked. Yes. Take a left through the airplanes and then go down to the end. It's really weird. Yes. Okay. So right. on echo here. Yep. Right on echo and make sure to dive away from the wind because it's strong right now. Winter Haven traffic, blue white star rate 333 zero. turning right on echo down to the end of 11 Winter Haven. Okay. Yeah, this isn't even on the airport diagram. This one is not even on your screen? Echo is on it, but it doesn't say that Fox truck connects with Echo. So see how the winds are pushing us pretty good? I take power out and just let it roll because it's... Yeah, see that? Yes. Yeah, so you gotta... If you see the airplane starting to go left or right, I want you to react real early and quickly. Yes. There's nothing wrong with running at full or at all the way at idle. Nope. There's nothing wrong with that. As long as the the mixture here is a lit, the mixture is lean because. Yep. There you go. And if you need to use brakes, please do. I'd way rather we use brakes than run off the taxiway. Yes. Is there a run up uh, sort of area there? I, I have no idea. So we'll just, we'll see what's down here when we stop. Yes. So remember too that the, um, okay, use a little brake, we'll slow down. There we go. We got a little bit of momentum? Yeah. Um, the, right, there we go. Yeah, because those ones are, and a little more dive away, so even further to the right. Okay. Uh, so what do I do here? So it looks like we're just going to put our butt uh, towards that and put your nose into the wind, so spin us all the way around. And I'd spin to the right. And to the right. Yep. Go like this. And give yourself some power. You have the control. Yep, I got the control. See how tight we can turn? Okay. And there our nose is in the wind. Wow. Right there. I wouldn't expect to do something like this. You can do that. Okay. Try it. Go stick back. Go and stick. give me a full turn all the way to the right. Give us a little power. More power. You gotta get put air over the rudder and let it roll just a little bit. Let it roll. Let it roll. Just let it roll a little bit. Put off the brake. Put off the brake. Let it roll. There you go. Ah. Okay. Yeah. You gotta let it get a little bit of, of space. Otherwise, you burn a uh, flat spot on the tire. Okay. Okay. So now here. So stick back. Stick back. Run up. Uh, my tail wheel, my trim, it is set for takeoff. My instruments are checked, my altimeter, everybody's on the green. Okay, that's good there. My fuel is checked with my quantity there, my quantity here. That bulb is flush. Okay, this door is locked. My mixture would go rich. I'm gonna sit back here and uh, check for my engine is at 1800 plus this guy here. Brakes applied, back is clear, good neighbor.
100. Engines are good there. The drop is within the limit. The drop is within the limit. Did you do the same magneto? Did you do both the right? Yeah, I did both. Oh, you did both? I did both. Okay. Okay. Okay, out air, out drop, idle, uh, mixture. Oh, I try to be gentle, it's too. I know, I know, it's, it's, yeah, just nice and slow. Go ahead, all the way back to idle. Back to idle. Okay. Uh, still running. Okay, that's good. Extra lean. Okay, throttle flight control, send this guy here. That is fine, and we're good to go. Okay, take off, okay. Transponder is in out position, we're good. We don't need to practice take off at this. Let it roll a little forward. There you go. And continue. Let it roll a little forward. Continue. Good. So what you're trying to do is not wear a bald spot onto the tire. So you got to let it roll. There you go. And a little more right. There you go. All right. And I believe we can see final this Okay. Way. So hold on one sec. One sec. So this is, you're really tight on there, up there, there you go. So that's why, so I know you're sitting on the left of the seat because it's always way tighter for my foot on this side. And I didn't move. So, okay, so let's close the window. Close the window. All right, there you go. Okay, and uh, we'll go up, hold up, go up to the hold short. Oh, one thing I know is a pet peeve of hers. Don't let your wing go over the hold short until you're actually about to go. That makes sense. No. Oh, yep. So, so turn, so turn your nose into it, and then I, what I'm saying is, don't let your wing ever pass the hold short. Ah, even no your way. wing, yeah. Even yeah, the wing. Even the wing. I know that's a pet peeve of hers. Okay. No. So I'll call here real quick. Okay, I'll call, you call? Yeah, you call. Okay. Winter Haven traffic, Citabria, 3 Juliet, Sierra, taking off 1-1, one, one, upwind for close traffic, Winter Haven traffic. Okay, I believe we're good. Fuel yep, pump just, is, just confirm no one's on final. No one is on final. Okay. My fuel pump is on and my mixture is full. So, and then where will we need the... Uh, where will we need the stick on takeoff? Uh, we need it down here. Well, yeah, but what, once we turn onto the... Oh, this way? Uh, once we turn with our nose down the runway, what direction is the wind hitting us? Uh, it's right. hitting a little bit to the right, yes. Rather, a lot to the right, yeah. A lot once to once the... we turn, yeah, exactly. Once we turn, that's going to be a good practice. Yeah. Haven, you have the Navajo uh, 543136 South, inbound landing for uh, 1 1 at Winter Haven to be a full stop. Alrighty. Okay. Regular landing, yeah. Glad to take off. Yep. Good. Get, get the tail up. There you go. Good. Hold that wind in. Good. Good. Hold that center line. Nice, Wilson. Hold it. Good. And or slow rotation. And right to the crab, right? Because it's pushing pretty good. Go. Just make sure to do whatever you can to hold that center line once you take off. Yes, even if it is crabby. Oh yeah, absolutely, big crab. Yeah, That's great. 55 feet with the alpha is about two miles to the north field. We'll the field right now with our one port. Hang on. I move. Yeah, what? you're moving. I'm moving. Try to try to just. Stay steady. Okay. Winter Haven traffic, Citabria upwind 1-1, one, one. Winter Haven traffic. Okay. That's bumpy. Yeah, I'm trying to die. 
Tower. Winter Haven traffic, Citabra entering left to downwind, 1-1, one, one. Winter Haven traffic. This baby likes to fly. Yeah, so this guy should be coming in south. Hey, Citabria, I have you in sight, and I'll be uh, number two behind you at Winter Haven. Roger that, we'll make it a short approach for you too, so you don't have to go out too far, thanks for that. No worries for uh, 313. Okay, he's got us in sight, so let's make it a short approach. Okay. So, uh, let's choose the second dash past 1-1. One, one. Second dash past 1-1. One, one. Yep. I'm almost there. All right, there you go. And that's it. All right, let's go in. Let's go in. It is windy, so you're probably going to have to <laughs> put your nose right into the wind to not lose too much altitude. Uh, second dot uh, after 11, all right. Yep, and announce you're on base. And uh, Winter Haven traffic, Citabria left base 1-1, one, one, closed traffic, Winter Haven traffic. Okay, 700. Okay. Yeah, these gusts are like really good. Looking good. So keep your spot in the same spot in your side window, and then as we make our turn on the final, have it be in your windshield. I'm still looking at you. Just don't get slow, okay? So keep that nose down. We need to keep our airspeed up. There you go. And we have power if we need it, okay? Don't. Yes. Don't, uh, don't push it that much? Right, exactly. All right, uh, I am... 300, wow, am I gonna make it? Haven, uh, uh, right for it. Huh? For no, I don't think we're gonna make it, so that's a power. That's a power. No, no, that's a little. Right there go, and one. going around. Point to Haven, traffic, uh, Citabra going around 1-1. One, one. I think the winds are almost like too powerful for that. Alright, let's do a normal landing and then we'll get out of here because this this is uh, almost uh, cross on component-ish. It yes. might even benefit us to get out of here now and uh, go back towards Kissimmee and we'll shoot. The wind's better at Kissimmee more. She wouldn't want us to be doing a check ride necessarily in these winds. She would give you the option. She'd say, hey, the winds are pretty crazy. Like, you know, what do you want to do? So she's... It's up to you, but I don't, I'm not one to exceed our crosswind component just to get a good crosswind landing in. It almost feels like that, doesn't it? I think it is. I think it's close. Okay. So I'd say let's uh, make a left turn back towards Kissimmee. Left turn back to Kissimmee. Yep. Winter Haven, Navajo 313 is the final turn for uh, 1 1 at Winter Haven. It'll be a full stop. And when you get a chance, go ahead and uh, call and say, uh, Winter Haven Traffic. Three Julie Sierra is departing the pattern on the uh, crosswind. Last call. Winter Haven Traffic, Citabria leaving the pattern from uh, Winter Haven. Winter Haven Traffic, Citabria, Three Julie Sierra. You can say, uh, departing the pattern on the crosswind. Departing the pattern on the crosswind, Winter, Winter Haven Traffic. Okay, so across a thousand feet, so what do we do with that fuel pump? We turn that off. Good. All right. and, uh, ahead of me, I Five think I see ten bits. Final. Is it ten bits? Isn't it? That, that uh, white area? Let's see. Yeah, I think those are them. So yeah, we're headed for those, and then Gore is directly in between. So why don't you just climb up to about 1,500, about where you are, 15 to 1,700. Yes. And uh, we'll cruise at this, and then uh, we'll come down to near Gore and uh, do our mates on pylons. All right. Pitch. Power, 1,200. And frame. And... Because it's a little turbulent today, you know, if you start getting going too fast, what do we need to do with the power? Uh, go 2100. Yeah, we'll just pull power back a little if we start okay. getting into the caution and being bumped around a lot. So we're going to go to Gore? Help yeah. me out where Gore is. Yeah, yeah, you're on a good uh, good heading right now. Okay. But I kept climbing. This baby likes to climb. I got 12, uh, 1700. the 
side wind. I know, right? And it keeps climbing. Apocas traffic, starting to warm way through Charlie on the upwind for runway 15, Apocas. Okay, go ahead and flip over to 121.97. Bob said it's raining right now at Kissimmee, so I, I'm going to have him update us when it uh, passes. He said it's light to medium. Go ahead and flip over. Flip over to it. There you go. You're going to call them? Um, he's actually saying it would be fine, so it turns out... Uh, we can go back anytime we want. So, we'll just do our plan so your heading's good. We're heading straight for Gore right now. All right, keep climbing. <laughs> Is there a blink here? Dang it. Look okay. at that. 11 o'clock. Oh no, that's uh, the airship. That's airship? A, that's an airship. Yeah, they came through the other day too. Okay. So obviously they have the right of way, right? So, so don't get in the way of him. And it's supposed to be close to Kissimmee, doesn't it? Isn't he? Yeah, he's, uh, he goes just outside of their airspace. He, he trims the uh, outer of the Delta. Okay. Yeah, the other day I was out with another student, and I was like, what the heck? Is that a, is that a balloon or uh -huh. an airship? It's totally an airship. Okay, okay, so we should be flying over Gore right now.